As Calvary Chapel pastor, can you give us some background on the history of Calvary Chapel? Calvary Chapel is a um, is really part of what was called the Jesus Movement. Pastor Chuck Smith is the senior pastor over Calvary Chapel Costa Mesa. Around 1965, Pastor Chuck uh, took over as uh, an assistant at Calvary Chapel in Costa Mesa and eventually was moved into uh, the position of senior pastor. And while he was there, he began to get a burden, develop a burden for, for, the, uh, for the youth because in the late 60s, there was such a revolution of music and, and politics and things, and there were so many people that were so uh, disenfranchised, disillusioned, that uh, a, a movement began called the hippie movement. And uh, Chuck would see these kids that swarmed the beaches who were not working, were taking drugs, and living lives that he was really displeased with and actually preached against. And Chuck would see these kids and at first was disgusted by them. But his wife Kay and he used to go and there in Huntington they would pray for the hippie kids who would be walking by. And Kay would cry and Chuck would just look at the kids and he would think, why don't you take a bath and get a job? You know, that was his generation. But his wife's tears for the kids uh, really spoke to his heart. So. He began to want to meet a hippie, and eventually his daughter had a friend who was a hippie and all, and they were able to connect, and Chuck saw some things in this young man that really spoke to his heart. So he eventually began to uh, have ministry that was more open to receiving these disenfranchised kids. And so right around 1968, 69, into 1970, hippies began to find welcome, find themselves welcome at Calvary Chapel, Costa Mesa. And um, that's when Pastor Chuck began to have tremendous impact on, on all of these kids. I was one of those kids that would show up at that time. And uh, Calvary Costa Mesa's uh, love and grace and value system and all of that really impacted me. And so Chuck never intended to plant all these churches. There are 1,500 Calvary chapels now worldwide. He simply wanted to pastor the church that God gave to him. But as a result of that, his ministry impacted so many others that we took it and brought it into the future. But it began back in 1965 or so when Chuck became the assistant pastor at Calvary Chapel in Costa Mesa, eventually became senior pastor, opened up the church to young people, made us feel welcome, and then from there, the rest is history.